The Rangers and Astros, that battle for the silver boot here at Minute Maid Park tonight, where these two teams, of course, have grown to dislike one another quite a bit. Now the Rangers playing good baseball. The Astros play very well here at home. They've won nine straight, but this does seem to be a place where for the Rangers have some comfort. If there is a home away from home for the Rangers, it's right here. Hunter Brown gets the ball today. It's the second time he's faced this team this year, but this is a different Hunter Brown than the one the Rangers saw in that first start. That ERA taking a nosedive in the second part of his season. Five and a half runs less than in the first nine for him. Marcus Simeon will lead things off for the Rangers. And that's up the middle. Bounces off the base. Out into left field. And that's a base hit. Well, luck to be a lady tonight. That is, that is some pretty good fortune right there for Marcus Simeon. It's like the hard chip that hits the pin. Foul tip caught by Yiner Diaz. Seager goes down on strikes. Hunter has his first strikeout of the night. Tailing off the outside edge away from that swing. And the Rangers have two men on with one out for Wyatt Langford. Deals and that one is lined to third base. Oh, that's a tough break. Bregman right there. Ball well struck by Langford but for a hard second out. This one looped in the right center field coming on McCormick with a diving attempt and he makes the play to end the inning. Chaz McCormick saves a couple of runs with a diving catch on the dying fly ball off the bat of Garcia. Chazzy Fizz coming up big with runners on picking up Hunter Brown and finishing that first inning in a big way. Texas sends Andrew Heaney to the mound. There's his three and nine record. 18 games 17 starts 90 innings pitched. The ERA just under four especially since May 1st. He has really started to turn things around. One two pitch and he strikes out Altuve. That's a great way to begin his evening here tonight. Gets him to chase out of the strike zone with a breaking ball. And that is a beauty. Strike three called Bregman down looking two away. Oh, you can't place it much better than that. And that's popped up. Playable on a short right field for the second baseman Simeon. And the inning is over. Second inning coming up low. Heim and Tavares. 2-1. And that's hit in the air. Third base side foul territory. Bregman racing over by the Rangers. Dugout makes the catch. Reaching into the dugout on the backhand. One away. That's a heck of a play by Alex Bregman. He got to the railing early and was able to gather himself under control and then reach over to make the catch. So Heim is the second player to walk against Brown for Leody Tavares. Ground ball to World Tube. He'll go to Pena for one. Speedy runner. Do they turn it? Yes. Double play. Tavares just thrown out on a nice relay by Jeremy Pena. Top of the third, Travis Jankowski in the box. Swing and a miss. He got him with the changeup on a 3 2 pitch. Nicely done for Hunter Brown's second strikeout. Their line drive over the head of Pena, trying to elevate as much as he could. But Simeon continues to hit well against Hunter Brown. He's now 10 for 15 in his career against Brown. First pitch, ground ball right side, charging Altuve, backhands, underhand toss to Pena on the first double play. 4 6 3 double play, second in as many innings turn. Andrew Haney delivers to Mauricio Dubon, and he hits the first pitch on the ground. A two hops, and it's booted by Seeger. Seeger playing it off to his left. Looked like it hit off the heel of his glove. And Mauricio Dubon reaches what will likely be scored as an error to begin the bottom of the third. No score, Astros and Rangers. So Andrew Haney, after the first two reach, getting a couple of harmless pop-ups on the infield from Bregman and Altuve. And there are two out for Alvarez. Ground ball, left side, could be trouble. Backhanded by Seeger. He's going to throw to first. And Dubon never stopped. He scores. Dubon never stopped around third. Jordan beat the throw by Singer. It's 1 0 Astro. And then Mauricio Dubon not hitting the brakes, making a turn, going home. You could see a slight hesitation as he read where that ball was going, but he scored easily. Singer just couldn't get a grip. I guess you know who's coming up. And only surrounded by McCormick on a soft line drive to right his first time and the pitch is under his chin for ball one and the crowd gets a rise out of that and he takes one off the elbow and that one is not it's not so much that it's going to hurt the elbow it's the intent or perceived intent that could create or ruffle some feathers perhaps here in this fourth inning ground ball to Altuve they will make the play to first and that'll do it for the Rangers in the fourth. The hit batter, one man left on base. We head to the bottom half. One nothing Astros. One out, nobody on for Jake Myers. Flight out to right center his first time. Jake hits one high and deep to left field. Doesn't have enough all the way back. It's gone! Jake Myers makes 
makes it 2 0. His ninth home run of the season. Jake with the rake. Putting a power bomb to left center field. Got a four seam fastball, middle in, and turn on in. 382 foot bomb. There's Bregman. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout and a foul out. Pitch on the way. He hits one well to left field. That ball all the way back towards the corner. Same spot as Jake Myers. Greggy gets number 12 on the air. It's 3 0 Houston. Greggy bombs. Who loves this place? And it's smashed through the middle for another base hit for Jordan Alvarez. He's on base for the third time tonight. Two for two with a walk and an RBI. The bouncer, second base. Simeon is right there. Goes out playing with the inning. Is done. But another solo home run by the Astros. Marcus Simeon to get it started here. And that one is up the middle base hit. His third hit tonight. And a good way to start the sixth inning. So a leadoff single. Let's see if the Rangers can make something happen here as Corey Seager comes up. And this ball in the air left field. And I think that one got lost. No, it's gone. Seager puts it into the Crawford box seats. A two run homer and the Rangers right back in this game for Corey his 18th home run the Rangers are on the board now trailing only 3-2. That's a swinging strikeout here that is strikeout number four all the way to six. He knows what to say that one lined into right field Garcia delivers so they hit him last time on the elbow he delivers a two out single this time and that's in the dirt gets away and Garcia will trot to second on the wild pitch not insignificant and a call third strike Hunter Brown fired up as he heads to the dugout gave up the home run didn't give up the lead Astros still lead three to two diesel gets the strikeout bottom of the sixth inning at Minute Maid Park Astros with a three to two lead over the Rangers who turn to their bullpen and bring in right hander Jose Urania ball four sees eight pitches works out a walk that was hard earned by Dubon and that prolongs the inning for Chaz McCormick a little tapper Chaz is going to have to hustle played by Josh Smith high throw and it gets beyond the first baseman low. Dubon will be held up at third. Chaz in the second. The Astros will have two runners in scoring position here with two outs. Just got a little bit careless with that throw. Really didn't finish it. Big spot here with two out. Two men in scoring position with Jose Altuve standing in. He goes high. He goes deep. He goes for a three-pointer. It's gone. Altuve gets to the 6-2 game. That was a hanging changeup that absolutely got blasted. And a no doubter off the bat. Ryan Abreu first one out of the bullpen for the Astros to face the bottom third of the Rangers order. Marcus draws the walk. Corey Seager will bat. Bouncer by second base hit. Jankowski around third. He'll score. Simeon cruises to third. The RBI single by Corey Seager makes it a 6 3 game. Try to hold up. Goes too far. Third strikeout for Smith. That'll do it for the Rangers in the seventh, but they had a run. They sit by Seager, makes it 6-3. He's driven in all three for Texas. Ninth inning, 6-3. Astros lead the Rangers, and Josh Hader is on to try and get the final three outs, looking to pick up the save for a second straight day. Pop up. Singleton looks like he'll have room. He does. Ball game. Astros have won 17 of 21. Josh Hader has converted his last 18 save opportunities. The Astros have won their 10th consecutive game at home for just the second time in this building. Yeah, the Phillies are playing some baseball right now.